first look at uh, EG4 3000 watt inverter. Very nice unit. I'm going to be making a doing a review video of it um, in a little while once I get a little bit of experience with it. It has a nice uh, uh, web based uh, app as well. well. It's not terrible, anyways, and I'll show it to you. It looks very similar to the Power Mister unit. Um, the screen, the buttons, you know, it, it was all created off this, based off the same stuff, uh, but works very well, kind of slotted right in where the uh, power mystery used to go. Um, they provided really long battery cables, so I can put the battery, the Renji battery down a little bit lower, so it's not so top heavy. Um, but uh, it's working, this uh, accepts up to 500 volts DC input, uh, which is which is really, really nice. It means you can put uh, some big panel strings together. Uh, to get some more, get more power, uh, when the when the uh, when the sun isn't out as strongly as it uh, could be, uh, I'll show you the app uh, in a second. Here's a Power Mister app. Now uh, this is probably meant for an iPhone. I've got it on my uh, iPad Air 2, and it uh, works pretty well. Pretty simple. It was it's a bit of a barrier to set up. I'll I'll do a full review again and. Uh, uh, of what it takes to uh, set the unit up and uh, to get this app going. To get it going you basically need two applications. You need a client program and uh, then this Smart ESS application. So two of them to actually get it online. It's a bit of a bear. Uh, but you can see it's pulling in uh, 35 watts. It's early morning. You can't really see that right now. Uh, it doesn't want to focus 35 watts anyways and you can see it's pulling 234 watts out of the battery and if you trace it it's all going to the house which is only pulling about 166 watts right now I've got one room off grid uh, basically right now as I'm kinda of getting this set up and tested and then if the battery runs out uh, it'll start uh, pulling power from the grid in so I'll, sh I'll give you a, like I say a fuller uh, more full review um, over the next number of uh, days and, or a week or so um, and tell you what I think of the EG4 unit so far uh, so good like I say the, the app is a bit of a, a tricky thing to set up um, but uh, it does uh, seem to be working here's a, a quick look at the charts here this is very nice once I get some history uh, that'll be nice the green is the, the power generation uh, and it's not showing very much because this uh, I just got it installed last night and then um, uh, sorry, the, the green is the load. Uh, the green is my load throughout the night. Um, the red there is the power generation because we're coming. It's just morning time now and it's picking up. And it's about 40 watts right now, early in the morning. And it's cloudy out now as well. So the hope is that that red uh, overtakes the green, of course, and uh, charges uh, the battery and supplies the house load. So uh, lots of options in here, but I'll do a further video of it uh, a little bit later. Thanks for watching. Um, it's time to be getting uh, prepared uh, for what we what we know is coming. A lot of trouble in the world. Even if the Lord doesn't return, um, there is a lot of trouble uh, coming upon this planet. Uh, economic collapse, uh, famine, uh, all sorts of things. So uh, get as prepared as you can. Uh, we don't know what exactly is coming, uh, but we can make some uh, fairly good guesses. Um, I'll leave it there, guys. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for.